on Inanimate and Sandy. Wow, I can't believe it's the finale. You know, I think I'm gonna recap every episode really super quickly. Ready, go. First time on Inanimate Insanity. The initial contestants were introduced. Baseball, knife, paper, OJ, taco, nickel, salt, pepper, bomb, marshmallow, paper, pickle, and balloon. Oh, come on! Lightbulb and Balloon became the team captains in the animation song. Lightbulb and Balloon picked the teams, Epic and Chicken Life, don't ask. Balloon may have been bossy, but Taco's random lemon spitting led the Chicken Life to victory, and paper was a limit. The contestants had to pelt rocks at each other. Despite knife strategy, the nickel and baseball power duo and Lightbulb doing nothing, Team Chicken Life won again and baseball went bye bye. Balloon tried to take advantage of his alliance with OJ and Bomb during a sling tot challenge. Pickle and Taco defeated a roasted marshmallow, don't ask, and Team Chicken Life won again. Lightbulb was unfairly eliminated, and boring golf ball stacking commenced. Viewers voted off that meaning knife, and the ignoramus Apple joined the game. Nickel's team finally won a challenge, but immediately after, Nickel was swapped out with Lightbulb, who rejoined. Team Chicken Leg voted off that bossy balloon, and OJ and Bomb reconstructed their alliance to fit in Pickle and Taco, but their team ended up losing due to Salt and Pepper's diet. Mifon 4S tried to steal the cell from the host Mifon 4, but was defeated. Pepper was eliminated, and Salt was set. Lightbulb was re-eliminated by one vote, and Salt revealed she had a thing for OJ. Marshmallow and Apple had a conflict over the existence of Santa Claus, who turned out to be real. Yeah. Paper rejoined the game, even though he appeared to have evil problems, and this weird chair enthusiast Bo joined too. Bomb betrayed his friend OJ to win a challenge, and OJ didn't like that. Both Salt and Paper were eliminated, and OJ quit his alliance, including Bomb, to join one with Crazy Paper, who won the aquatic challenge. Mifon 4 pushed me off a cliff, and we quietly settled our case out of court. Oh, and Bomb was eliminated, Marshmallow snapped at everyone. The rivals Apple and Marshmallow faced off in an elimination tiebreaker, and Marsh ended up being eliminated. Paper finally faced his evil self during a wrestling challenge and conquered him using a piano. The eliminated contestants tried to escape but failed. Apple was eliminated just before Taka ran out of lemons, and while Pickle was trying to help her find more, they inadvertently ended up winning the challenge. Mifon 4S came back to tell 4 someone was coming, but 4 trapped him in a cave before he could finish. Bo was eliminated and put in a rather small box, and OJ finally won a challenge with Paper's help. Pickle and Taco had to part ways when Pickle was eliminated, and in a shocking twist, the contestants got to eliminate a second person. After Salt and Pepper broke up as BCFFs over OJ, Paper ended up getting eliminated again, leaving OJ and Taco as the final two competing for the $1 million prize. <laughs> And that's what you missed on, Anatomy and Sand. Hey, Nickel! How's it going? Eh, it's going pretty good, I guess. Except for the fact that we've been in this stupid cage for months. Well, it's not that bad. Are you kidding me? Yeah, what are you saying, Baseball? It's awful here. I mean, the only thing worse than Idiotic Island. <coughs> oh, no! <laughs> <coughs> Sorry! <sighs> Had to sneeze. But it isn't as bad as I remember. Yeah, and plus, we've all learned so much from each other over all this time. Hey, who wants to leave Idiotic Island? Ah! Get me out of here! I'm telling you, the finale will go fine. Ugh, whatever. Just make sure Mifon 4S doesn't escape or something. I may have screwed up in the past, but I assure you, everything will go according to plan. <laughs> All right, you idiots. After over a year of competition, watching their friends and enemies leave one by one, only Orange Juice and Taco are still in the game. Awesome! <laughs> but the million dollar prize can't go to both of you, so in order to decide this, you will compete in one final challenge. The winner of this challenge gets the million, and the loser gets squat. Oh man, that's rough. Not even a million squats. Hey, can we leave this scrap fest yet? Not yet. Sit on the bleachers of the contestant you think will win. Taco. Oh. Wow, almost everyone here has got my back. Maybe even Balloon. No, not really. Screw you. Now the final challenge is what I like to call the master challenge. Huh? What's that? It's every contest combined. Just in case you're brain dead and you've forgotten, the challenges in order are <gasps> the Crappy Cliff, Lemon Collecting, Arena of Death, Slingshot Contest, Stacking Three Golf Balls, Obstacle Course, Candy Collecting, Quicksand Crossing, Christmas Tree Contest, Crossing the Cactus Desert, Finding a Golden Corn in the Lake, Crappy Cliff Again, Wrestling Contest, Capturing Eliminated Contestants, and finally, Tile of Terror. OJ, for winning the last challenge and for having the most fans here, you get a prize. How is a cork gonna help me? You'll see. Okay, let's not waste any time. You guys ready? Good luck, Taco. Start. I can't swim. What do I do? Oh. Oh. 
Funko has a huge lead. Wow! You can see all the way over there with that? No, but I bet she is. Me phone! We have to sneak out to the island, now! Hey, you're not welcome here. Talk to the hound. Hello! Now listen to me very carefully. I'm here to help you, not hurt you. He's gonna terminate us and take the million. Who? I tried to warn you, you senseless blockhead. It's too late now. Who is that? The new me phone. He's like twice as fast and half an inch taller. Liquid metal technology. You heard me. And nobody saw this coming. Nobody. Lau! Why does he want to kill me? The same reason I was out to terminate you last year. That's right. We can have the public watch this terminating me from Forest Fest. We can eliminate me from Fuller. Once I'm done with you two, I will retrieve that million dollars and you can't stop me. Come with me if you want to live. What? Duh, just come. Man, I don't even see Taco, and I'm terrible at stacking golf balls. <laughs> Taco, I finally caught up, and now I'm gonna pass you, and, well, stop narrating myself. Huh? Oh. He'll never find us up here! So you're like my protector now? You could say that. It's my mission. Will you like do whatever I tell you to? Mephone says, stand on one foot. Ow! Don't push me! Master! What do you want, Siri? Grab my hand! Not so hard! Hold on! I need a vacation. You can pack your puny bags later. She's so quick and agile. That's not the taco I've been competing with. How is she doing so well? Why are you asking me? Before you pass, you must answer a riddle. Oh, uh, try to catch me and put me in the bin. Um, you know what? No worries. Sour cream! Before you pass, you must answer a riddle. Okay. What is the one thing that can help you in your time of need, can lead you to accomplishing your goals, and has everything? Hmm, of course, Walmart. Walmart has everything. It sort of does. Um... Uh, catch Bob and put him in the bin. <coughs> Ugh! Ah! Oh no, this is a lot harder without paper. What the? I'm not gonna ask. Whoa! Easy there, Bo! Uh, remember when you gave me this chair? Chairs! Oh, how I missed you. Wait, chairs? Um, gee, these are so like last year. I did it! I won Inanimate Insanity! Ah! 
stop cheering, you fools! Um, what? This is all wrong. I was built to win. My plan was perfect. What? Did squeeze me? Yes, you were all utterly fooled. Do you honestly think that I was that half-witted? I merely pretended to be an idiot, not to be seen as a threat, and to make the viewers like me more. What? I don't understand. Of course you don't. You were never really my friend. You were just part of my cover. Hey, lay off pickle, British taco. So be it. It wasn't his fault my strategy fell short of success anyway. It was that demented pink headgears. Yeah, whoever that is, shame on them. It's you, you dolt. But luckily enough, me phone is nowhere to be seen. And I'm not gonna let Bo stop my plan from completion. Hey, come back! Is that me phone 5? Wow, what an unexpected guest! No way, Jose! Wait, 4S, don't! <laughs> He's got a rubber ball. Me phone, what is going on? Ugh, Adam, this isn't really the best time. It's rather cliche and ironic timing, actually. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in. <laughs> oh no! If only there was someone who was stupid and crazy enough to go take him down! Hi, Marshmallow! <laughs> Oh no! What? Unhand me, you uncultured breakfast beverage! I will not be threatened by Mexican food! When will you see me? I'm destined to be your replacement, your DVD, and I'm the Ray! Well, in that case, hasta la vista! Blu-ray, you belong in VCR land! No, me phone! Oh, how could this happen? And there's no way to bring him back. Maybe there is a way. Hugh. I cannot self-terminate. You must slide to downgrade me to Mi OS 4. And you think this will bring back Mi Phone 4? Correct. No, I order you not to go. I order you not to go. I'm sorry, Siri. I know now why I was a bad guy. But it's something I can never undo. Goodbye. phone? Ow! What happened? What? What? What happened? Me phone's alive! But how? Me phone for us was able to give his body up for you. I guess deep down, me phone for us did have some good in him after all. Well then, I hope there weren't any side effects from 4S's transformation. Hello! That's gonna take some getting used to. calling me phone you let everything go completely out of control look i'm sorry i guess i won't be hosting next season what no with all the mass hysteria our ratings hit an all-time high please host again for season two uh, i'll raise your pay 20 percent hmm well i want my own personal assistant done hey buddy so it must suck knocking in the million after all the work you've put in. Ugh, well, what are you gonna do? Wait a minute. What do you mean? The million dollars. It's gone. Wait, you mean the case? The money's in the bank, not the case. What kind of idiot would put a million bucks in a suitcase? Well, I wouldn't put it past you. So what are you gonna spend the million on, OJ? You know, 
Sometimes people let greed take over their lives. Oh boy, here he goes! People put all their efforts into doing something to give them a sense of purpose. Whether it is becoming a millionaire or going on a murderous rampage, I think in Forrest's last moments, he realized what it is that really makes you feel fulfilled. And I think I have too. Yeah, yeah! Enough with the six-hour speeches! What is it? It's whether or not a person has some nice friends around them for support. Sometimes life can get about as crappy as a cliff dive into elephant feces. Ew. And your friends are the only ones there to make the hard times not so bad. So I'm gonna put the million dollars towards something for all of us. Aww. Cause there's nothing more valuable than friendship. <coughs> er, other than Walmart, I suppose. And... Also for winning in out of insanity, you get a cookie! Oh really? I do. Yep, here it is. Whoa, seriously? Go on. So someone's finally gonna taste one of Meatbone's cookies, huh? Oh my gosh. OJ, tell us what it tastes like. It tastes like crap! Oh my gosh, did you bake these? All by myself. Just forget about me? I'm lonely. Wait, what does two mean? <laughs>